Okay, so I'm going to tie a leggy version of the Bibio. The hook I have on the vise is a size 12 standard bat fly hook. The thread I'm going to use to tie the fly is uni thread, 80 and black. So I'll just go ahead and attach the thread behind the eye of the hook along the length of thread and remove the waist. The next part of the fly is the rib. It's going to be a length of silver wire. Now you can use oval silver tinsel if you wish. I just find the wire lasts a, a tad longer on the fly. So then bring your thread down until you're in line with the barb of the hook. Now the Bibio body is in three parts. First part's black, red, black. And the materials that I'm going to use create the body is seals fur so I'm going to come in with a pinch of black seals fur first and I'll just dub that onto the thread just work this up the body to there then I'll come in with a pinch of red seals fur and just when you're dubbing the seals fur just finger and thumb Gentle pressure the one way, and we'll add our red seals fur onto the hook. To there, and then we'll come in with a pinch of black to finish off the body. A bit short, so we'll come in with another wee pinch. Just a tiny drop, just to finish off the front. Anything that's going forward at this stage, just sweep it back, get a couple of turns in there. Now, there's going to be a body hackle on the fly, and it's going to be Janie's cock hackle dyed black. So we'll just remove any of the rubbish from the stem of the fiber. We'll just offer this up to the hook. Tie that in. Then I'll come in and remove away the excess stem. Right, with this being a size 12, I'll come in and Touch my haggle pliers to my haggle, and then what I'm going to do here is, is to get a turn at the top and one turn in behind on the black, and then what I want to do is, is sweep the haggle forward, missing the red section, and getting two turns haggle at the back of the fly at this stage just come up with your wire catching in your tip of your haggle and then get four turns going up the body now you can come in and remove your haggle pliers at this part stage and then come in and just break away the tip now before you bring your wire up sweep all the haggles that's going forward back come up with your wire followed by your thread and just come in with a couple of nice tight turns to hold the wire don't cut away the wire you'll just blunt your scissors so just stage I just hold my thread tight and come in and just bend and break away the wire sweep everything that's going forward back Bring your thread back up against the haggle. Now I'll come in and with a wee bit of Velcro, just bring out any haggle fibers that has been caught. You can bring it up your rib. This will bring out some of the seagull's fur as well. There's no point in putting dubbing on a fly if you're not going to brush it out, in my opinion. So that's ground. 
next part of the fly is some pre knotted pheasant tail legs in red. I've already selected a three for each side. So I'm going to tie three in on your side. I have the move around or underneath, just bring them back and come in with a couple of tight turns. And then I've selected another three for my side. Just get these the same length. Come in and tie those in. Just bring them down the side again. There. And then at this stage we'll just come in and remove the waist of the banded fasten tail legs. I'll just get a bit of thread down here and tidy up the cut ends from my front haggle. And my front haggle is going to be the same Chinese cock haggle dyed black. So just stroking back the fibers to expose the tip. Then tie the tip in, a couple of turns down, fold the tip back, come back, bring your thread back up over the tip, securing it in, and the haggle. Come and locate your tip, another cut or break away. Now at this stage I'll come and just gently run my scissors up the stem of the haggle. Now start to fold them back for me. Then I'll come round with a couple of turns of haggle at the front. One turn in the front of the other. Right. Depending on the haggle favours, depending on how many turns you put in. So, you see. That's enough for me there. So what I'll do now is I'll come round with my thread, just tan in my hackle, sweep everything back, and then just bring your thread up over your hackle. Now I'll be one there to sweep it back. Just be patient, creating your head. Then keeping your thread tight, come in and remove the waist of the hackle. Still keeping your thread tight, come in with your whip finishing tool. Just tidying the head up at the same time. Just whip finish. And then come in and remove the thread. Right. Last part of the fly, just to finish off. Put on a couple of coats of varnish. This varnish that I'm using is Sally Hansen's as hard as nails. So I'll just come around the whole fly, even in the eye. Don't worry about that. Right. I waste a bit of wire here on my desk. I'll just come in and clean the eye. There you go. That's the. We leggy bibio. Give it a try.